Uh, so I know you can tell. <laughs> We're getting hay. Uh, this is for Dahlia. Uh, she's due to have a calf here in about 25 days or so, and she's off pastures. Uh, yeah, let's shut the gate. We're gonna go move the cows to new pasture because they're hungry. Inside. It's hot out today. It's October and we're getting this heat wave in the Midwest. It's been uh, very sunny in mid 80s. Uh, Juliet, Andrew, let's go move the cows real quick. Anything you want to show or tell the camera? No? Okay. Do you want me to tell? Oh. She got her braces on today. What did you get? Pink and green or pink and teal? She's adorable. She's growing up. It's like uh, certain stages you just watch and it's like your kid just transforms right in front of your eyes from being this little baby into being almost like a young adult. She's 13, and it's like me seeing Father of the Bride. Papa, I'm getting braces today. What up? How you guys doing? Are y'all pregnant? Interesting. You and the piggy wits. Hi. Need to clean their water out pretty badly. Hey, girl. Hey, cow. Tell you what. They're making it easy on us. We could probably just hit pasture two here. Yeah, I can get over without getting zapped. It ain't graceful, but it worked. I don't know if I can get over this one. Where are you going? Like, we know what you're doing. You gonna unplug it or are we doing it with it live? So we've been watching this cow here. We don't have a name for her, but she's got some of those face warts. And we've looked it up, and uh, it's like a like a viral thing that calves get. And I mean, these guys are almost a year old now, just a hair under. And apparently, there's a, a viral thing. It is contagious, and it can give the other cows warts as well if they get the virus. But uh, it's something where they just—is it off? Well, awesome. Fence is off. It's something where uh, they are, it's not, it's not life-threatening, it doesn't make them actually ill or anything, so, get back. Nope, scooch. Jake, can you pop that open for me? Try and keep here. Yeah, we need to get some fly spray on you guys. You be careful with David. Just living their best cow lives. These guys every two days, sometimes less, are getting uh, fresh grass. Twist it in here.
But that's our uh, pasture system. It's, uh, what is it, nine on each side, Jay, or 10 on each side? Do you remember? I think we have it set up for 10 on each side. Don't touch it, Jay. I touched it, but it didn't zap me, <laughs> thankfully. <sighs> Makes me happy to get the cows out on pasture. Make you happy, Junes? Not really is the official uh, stance. <sighs> yeah. That means work together. Aww. Joy and Josie. Hey, little, little ones. Well, this is our. Uh, calf from our original cow so if you've been around Hashley Farms for a long time um, well if you've been a short time you know we got Joy and this is her calf Josie Joy's mom was Josie as well and we are brand new cow owners never had cows and so our baseline when we got Josie she was almost eight months pregnant had the calf and we ended up not noticing that she was acting off and it turned out that Josie senior had uh, picked up pneumonia so we slowly were starting to figure that out joy was a little baby she was way smaller than this and uh josie ended up dying we had the vet come out but she ended up dying uh, we just we we didn't know we didn't know her signals like showing that she wasn't feeling good and because we didn't have a good baseline and we didn't know uh, how bad off it was once we figured it out. So it was a learning experience. But now with our cows, I'd say all of them now, we've got a pretty good baseline of them healthy. And so we can tell when one's not feeling good. You know, different signs, whether it's being snotty, coughing, acting differently, holding their heads differently. You know, you, you learn those things <clears throat> by, you know, having and being around your animals. So. Just something to think about if you are thinking of getting a cow just know that that's something you're gonna have to pay attention to good questions that you might ask you know what's her temperament normally um, is she she normally uh, cough a lot some cows when they're bringing their cud up to chew will instead of doing one or two big kind of <laughs> cough things get it up in their mouth they do you know 10 or 12 I think uh, Dolly is like that. She'll sit there and you'll think she's having a coffin fit. <coughs> she only does it every once in a while. And when uh, she's done, she's just chewing her cud and she's fine. So anyways, whew, it is warm out there. Appreciate y'all. Um, what do we say at the end of the video? Like and subscribe. Say please like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Woo!